Let's mount up. Hey guys, so it's July already, uh, which is crazy. Um, actually, it's all, it's like July 10th, so it's almost halfway through July. Um, but yeah, it's definitely time to start thinking about Halloween and uh, what we're going to be doing this year. Uh, last year was kind of a bummer because we had just moved into this house, so uh, we just didn't have time to, to put everything up like we normally do. Um, so this year, uh, we're definitely excited. Uh, we've got a good-sized lot, um, a lot bigger than our old place, which is awesome. Uh, it's going to be a challenge because we've got to figure out we're basically starting from scratch. We're going to use the same haunt. Uh, we're still going to be doing Restless Hollow. Um, but we got to figure out how to set everything up now because uh, it's all going to be totally new. Um, so that's cool. Uh, we got a lot of repairs to do. Uh, the move was definitely uh, tough on our uh, on our facades. Uh, so we have a lot of pieces falling off. Got a big box of random stuff that we need to go through and figure out uh, where all that goes. So fix that up. I uh, got some repairs to do on the shooting gallery. Uh, one of the guns stopped working last year, so we need to fix that. Um, maybe we'll get to do some new stuff. Uh, I talked about last year or the year before, whatever it was, um, doing the photo booth. Um, I still think that'd be awesome if we could uh, pull that off for this year. Um, so yeah, we got a lot of excitement going on and I just thought I'd make a little uh, vlog here to talk about uh, what we're gonna do and show you some stuff and maybe kinda get things moving here, get some motivation to get something done. Maybe, hopefully. Hey, Polly, how are you doing? Wow, we have a lot of stuff to go through here. Check out those wheels though. Those are from Tractor Supply. Those are pretty cool. We're excited about those guys. Yeah, we got a lot of work to do here. Got these cool uh, metal panels here. Some corrugated metal from our friends who are moving. So these can uh, turn these guys into some roof for one of our buildings or something. Got some more pallets, which is always good. Um, yeah, so you can make something out of that. They're already nice and weathered, which is always nice. Got all this metal framing material over here, but that's not actually for anything Halloween related. Uh, that's gonna be for an outdoor kitchen. Which is gonna be awesome, if I ever have time to build it. All right guys, so I thought I'd take you on a, a quick little tour of our property here uh, to show you what we have to work with. Uh, the new place is great because it's uh, quite a bit bigger than the old one. Uh, we're at about half an acre here uh, and the old place was uh, less than half of that so we got a lot more room here to work with which is awesome uh, so let's go take a look all right so our driveway is on the side of the house which is nice um, we've got a ton of room over here um, our driveway goes all the way down there we've got all this room on the side of the house um, we're not going to do anything with this to start but uh, this could actually be a great place for like a walkthrough if we wanted because we have all this uh, room here which would be pretty cool. Uh, there's the shed that came with the house. It's all falling apart. And then there's the uh, new one that I've uh, showed you in some past videos. This is the front yard of our house here. Got quite a bit of room up here. Um, it's kind of like a little triangle up here. Uh, but I don't think we're gonna set anything up here um, because we've got some great space on the side. So let's go see that. All right, so here's another view from this side of the yard, front yard. And then this is the rest of our front yard over here. So we've got a ton of space over here. Um, so I think that's what we're gonna go ahead and use for our setup, which should work out really well. All right, and here is the backyard. We've got the uh, fair amount of space over here. Um, and then we've got the swing set for the kids. We got this awesome pergola that we got built. Uh, I wish we could have built it ourselves, but uh, we uh, whisked out on that one and uh, 
hired a company to do it for us, but they, he did an awesome job on this and they, they put in this whole patio here. This was just all grass. Uh, so we got a ton of space out here now, which is awesome. But anyway, uh, back to uh, our hunt stuff here. Um, last time I had the shooting gallery set up in the garage, which I liked. Um, but since the garage is on the other side of the house here, that's not gonna work so well. Uh, so I think what we'll do is um, get one of those um, like pop-up canopy tents um, and then set that guy up over here somewhere um, and then build the gallery underneath and then I'd have to put in uh, a gate on the fence there or something. Um, and then maybe I was, the, the facade could actually be mounted to the fence there, um, the front of it. So that's what I'm thinking right now. Uh, hopefully that'll work out okay. I just got to figure out how to try to keep out water because I mean obviously that's all electronics in there uh, and I don't want that getting wet. So uh, that's the current plan. All right, well that's it for now guys. Uh, hoping to get started on projects soon. Um, got a lot to do this year so hopefully uh, get started early. Um, I think if I wait till October it's not going to get done. So got so many house projects going on. Actually I, you can see, let's see, here, look at that, it's not even painted, it's this, yeah, I've got so many projects like this around this house. So anyway, hopefully I can fit some time in to get Halloween stuff done, get paint on that wall, maybe next time you see me that'll be painted, maybe. So anyway guys, uh, thanks for watching, stay tuned, and we'll talk to you soon, hopefully.